Hello, welcome back everybody. This is Muhammad Said with you again. In this video, we will learn how to create navigation bars on the top and we're gonna also learn how to make those navigation bars work. Like they're not gonna be only text, they are gonna be working. So let's get started with our new video. So as you see guys here, I have all of my codes and now I'm going to explain what I have over here because it's a lot. It's not only this, but it's also this, 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 and this. So it's a lot. So here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain all of those files and why I created them. Um, so first of all, um, what I did is I made this, I typed in. Um, doc type HTML. This is what you always do, and the head and the HTML. We always do that when you start. Then the title. I made it my page. So don't worry about this code. I'm gonna explain it um, later. But here below it, uh, here's what I did. I well, with these LIs, I created. Um, I created tabs how those allies are like navigations so let me show you um so here as you see when i um open a live server this is what you're gonna do uh so these are the navigations as you see um on top it reloads but nothing happens because i didn't change something from inside so we're gonna do that in the second video so what's here is after i explain this oh and here what the div does is it makes a letter below the letter like if you said hello and on the other div world it's not gonna be next to each other so here as you see a b they're not next to each other so here the section you can make a section and you can call it uh, like you can make any text appear and use the footer here's the button so what this code does is and yes before i explain this you're gonna tell me okay where is all of the css that you're using i'm gonna explain this right after this because this have uh, has uh, something to do so here guys as you can see and this one, uh, this code says link. This is not a link that you type on Google. This says for this tells HTML to connect something. So here, when you uh, just type in link, then tab, you're gonna find this over here. And here you're gonna see hyper. This means hyperlink, and um, it's gonna it's gonna make you here. Now you have to type in what's the name of the folder that you've created. So just add a folder and call it styles.css. And now come over here and say styles.css. Uh, and now with this, this file, it has my CSS. So here, here's only my CSS so we can be um, like, this can be kind of neat. Someone can understand it. And um, this is better than a lot of things behind each other. So here, um, we connected this. Now let's see what are those contacts. So you don't really have to do something with this. If you don't want to do it and don't do it, it's not going to do anything. So this is just I created a new folder. So here, what I did is... I did the same thing with the contact and locations. I created a new two files and called them contact and locations because those are gonna be my tabs. So here, as you can see, um, li, um, then type in a. I don't know why it's supposed to be link, but it was always an a. I don't know why. Then behind it, type in H R E F hyperlink. Then um, index dot html. This is where we already are, which is the folder of the tab. 
that controls the tab, like it has the codes your locations dot html. Um, um, what does uh, it um, does everything with this? It manages it. So here, contact is the same as locations and index. So now, what do we have below this? Is here, as you can see, there's something called NAF. This is the navigation. It starts from over here and ends from over here. And why is that? Because in here is our navigations, is our tabs. So here, what codes do I have in locations? It's the same exact code. Even you, and you also have to uh, to link it because if you didn't link it to change any uh, if you change something over here it's not gonna be with the contacts or locations if you did this in another folder so here now i'm gonna explain every single thing here i typed in so i typed in doc type dot uh, html then html where we start coding then we are gonna make the head and here i'm not gonna go through the css but i'm gonna show you what it does and here my title is my page so here i linked and um, i linked this with the styles.css and here i end the head and i start the body below we have header add navigation so the navigation is inside the header what the navigation ha um, has inside it is those allies so here below them you have the uo it closes it because i started one over here and here is an h2 um what is an h2 it um like it shows up text but not the same text it's gonna be um big so and h1 h1 is the biggest h2 is the smallest is uh, smaller and maybe a thousand is the smallest like you might you might not even see it so here below it you end the header and start a div what this does is it prints everything on a line and here in the section we typed in lower section and the footer we typed in just footer this is what um, we're gonna print because if you have anything to type in there you can type it but we're just putting the footer there so we will not forget what this is so below it you have the button i made a button called learn more and how to make this thing like how to make this button react or does something you need to learn HTML. Um, I mean, you need to learn um, Java. So we're not gonna do this because I, we are gonna do this, yes, but not on these videos. Like after when we finish CSS and HTML, we will do this. So here, as you can see, contacts, index, and locations—they all have the same exact code, and and you can change it if you want and it's gonna print different things so let me show you here in the end index and um, the there's an h2 with the title let's say instead of it let's say page where where we where are we okay now we we are in the index let's change something in the contacts the title is gonna be world world and the locations it's gonna be hello okay hello now let's open it with live server here as you see in home i don't know if you guys can see this but here you see i'm highlighting it so you can see here there is page in home Okay, I'm in home and there's page. In locations, there is hello. In contacts, there's world. 
So why I'm highlighting so you can see because both of those are white. So I'm gonna change the background. Let me go over here to styles. Where, where, okay, here. I think this is the one. If it's uh, wrong, it's okay. We can use the other one. And it's, if it's wrong, it's okay. Contact, or you can go anywhere. Open up. And, okay, this was for the lower section. Let's come back. Okay, here it goes. Let's change it to red. And every color will work. And if you, like, don't want to type the name of the color, you can just hover next to the red over here. And I'm not sure why it's not working, but... Try doing it and it's gonna work. Oh uh, no, okay. Just try doing it sometimes and it's gonna work. Here, um, I'm on the E and it's working. Here you have a color selector. I'm not gonna use it because I already chose my um, color. Here. Okay, now as you see here, hello, you can see and home, you can see page. In locations you can see hello in contacts you can see world and this tells you that you can like can, it's it's like if you made 10,000 websites in one website with different pages so this is the end of the video I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you did please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel bye see you in the next video